Hi everyone, welcome to Informatica Global Customer Support. My name is Shivam Kumar Maria, and today we are going to discuss about the Flyer Portal installation. As part of this video, we are going to cover about uh, overview of Supplier Portal, prerequisites, steps to install Supplier Portal, followed by demo and reference. So, what is Supplier Portal? Supplier Portal is a web application. Uh, where supplier representative use the supplier portal to initiate a relationship with your organization and to fill out an online application form. After a user in your organization approve a supplier, the supplier representative use the supplier portal to upload, update and monitor the document. So what are the prerequisites? Prerequisites to, uh, to install the supplier portal. Uh, we need to have the MDM Supplier 360 installed. Also, we should configure uh, portal login provider uploaded to a security provider in Hub Console. So, let's discuss about the steps to install the portal. So, firstly, we need to add a parameter in CMX server dot property file that is portal dot cmx dot url. Based on your application server, you need to add uh, uh, the parameter. Like for JBoss, it, sh uh, it should be HTTP localhost 8080, and for WebLogic, it, it should be uh, HTTP localhost uh, 7001. After that, we need to run the command install portal.bat uh, from the path infamdm hub app portal bin. Once uh, this command runs successfully, we need to launch the uh, portal config tool. And from there, uh, in the portal config tool, we need to import a supplier portal zip file uh, that we get from the in, uh, InfoMDM app TCR supplier portal path. And once this uh, upload is complete, uh, we need to publish that. And uh, we have our uh, for this application supplier portal application ready that we need to start and uh, to launch the application we need to copy the url and paste it in the different browser that we will see in the upcoming demo let's start the demo so uh, so firstly we need to add the parameter in the cmx server dot property file so so yeah so the, the we have added this parameter portal dot cmx dot url and we have we have this jbos so we added this http localhost 8080 now we need to run the install portal dot bat command uh, we need to open the cmd command prompt to this app portal bin and we need to type this install portal dot bat so here we need to give the path for mdm hub installation directory so for our case the directory is uh, this now we need to uh, give the location for to install the uh, application uh, uh, this portal configuration tool so for this we will go here portal now we give we need to give the application server for us this is jbos the url to uh, access the portal now we need to give the administrator privilege that is admin uh, we need to give the active was console administrator privilege that is a was password for a was it is was one two three uh, so do we need to uh, integrate the MDM with product uh, 360 uh, for now 
this is we are taking this as no now this is running so here we need to give the database type that is ms sql ms sql uh, username for master database that is cmx cmx system password cmx sign by uh, host name it is local host port one four three three So for this, uh, we need to have this Cyprian MRM to be deployed. Uh, this is running. Let's wait for it to get complete successfully. So our uh, command got completed successfully. Now we uh, we will launch our config portal tool. To launch the uh, config portal tool, uh, we we need to use this URL. So we need to pass the credentials. So here uh, we will import the portal. So we need to choose the file. So this is the path. So we need to choose this uh, supply portal config.zip now we need to ch choose the database on which our uh, supply 360 is installed as part of our prerequisite so in our case this is cmx ORS. we need to have our source system we are taking it as a admin uh, now we need to give the portal name. We are giving it as a demo. Uh, there is no external authentication. So let's click on demo uh, import. So yeah, we can see that uh, this application is created here. So we need to start this application so first we need to click on three on this three dots and now click on edit and we need to publish this so now we will see the option to start the portal so this is up and running now if you want to launch you just copy the url and you can paste it in the browser here and so our supplier portal web application is ready we need to pass the credentials that we have created as part of sign up so this is what we have for we have as a demo for supplier portal installation so you can refer the below link for uh, more information regarding the supplier portal installation or supplier 360 so we would love to hear from you uh, you can give us your feedback on support video at the rate informatica.com or https twitter.com infra support hope you like this video thank you